let's find the derivative of f of x equals 1 over square root of x plus 2 using the definition of the derivative. We know the frame of x is limit of f of x plus h minus f of x over h as h approaches 0. Since the function is a fraction, to avoid having complex fraction, we say f of f prime of x equals limit of 1 over h times f of x plus h minus f of x as h approaches 0. 1 over h times f of x plus h minus f of x is the same as f of x plus h minus f of x over h. Therefore, the derivative would be limit of 1 over h times 1 over square root of x plus h plus 2 minus 1 over square root of x plus 2 as h approaches 0. We take the common denominator here, the common denominator between 1 over root x plus h plus 2 and 1 over root x plus 2 is root x plus h plus 2 times root x plus 2. We times the first fraction by root x plus 2 and the second fraction by square root of x plus h plus 2. To find the limit, we have to rationalize the numerator. Notice that Although we have radical at the denominator, but when x h approaches 0, they are going to be x plus 2 when we multiply them. We don't have any issue with the denominator. Therefore, we times it by the conjugate of the numerator, which is square root of x plus 2 plus square root of x plus h plus 2. By rationalizing the numerator, we get x plus 2 by multiplying this we get x plus 2 minus x minus h minus 2. If we collect the like terms, we have negative h on the top. Negative h and h crossed out. The derivative would be limit of negative 1 over the square root of x plus h plus 2 times square root of x plus 2 times square root of x plus h plus 2 plus the square root of x plus 2. When h approaches 0, the limit would be negative 1 over x plus 2 times square root of x plus 2. Thank you.